Welcome to Solid Bugs. To start, I have downloaded and imported a video and a picture. I'm going to zoom into his face, keep it zoomed in for a while, then zoom out again. But first I am going to show you a more complicated method by using a picture. Let's drag this out a bit longer. I'll add a background, just for fun. This looks better now. With this method we need to cut the video or picture in this case. Select the clip and hit the scissors icon to perform a cut. Next, move the playhead a bit. Now use the pan and zoom tool. Resize the end frame accordingly. Press OK. Cut again. The second part zooms in now as expected. We want to keep the zoom level for some seconds. In pan and zoom, select the end frame. Press the inverse selection button. Select crop then press OK. Move the playhead a few seconds forward. Cut. Move the playhead slightly. Cut again. Resize the end frame to full size. Press OK. Perform the last cut. Select the last clip. Resize the frame and hit OK. Let's play back the zoom in, hold, zoom out animation. For doing so, let's colorize the clips to make it more obvious to you. I use gray for the first and the last clip. This is the zoom in part. The long clip in green is the hold zoom part. Apply a color to the zoom out section. Hit the play button. So this was an old method to create a zoom in and out animation. As Filmora added keyframing, you basically don't need to cut a clip anymore. Move the playhead where you want to start zooming in. Select the clip. Double click the clip. Select the animation tab. Add a keyframe. Move the playhead. Add a second keyframe. Drag the scale slider. Change the position to fit the head. Move the playhead. 
Add two more keyframes and define the zoom out. Playback to see the results. Look good. You can always change the position of the keyframes. Using keyframes is more flexible than the first method. That's it. Thanks for watching.